How's it going? This is your boy Dorio TV, your boy Dorian Andrews, and I'm here. I'm back with another video for you. So today we're gonna look at one of my favorite game series of all time. You might be surprised by this. If you know me, you're not. Koei Tecmo's Samurai Warriors series. So I went to book off and I happened to find this bad boy. Samurai Warriors 3Z. Samurai Warriors 3 was an exclusive only for the Wii. So when they made an update version where you could play as Gracia, Aya, and uh, Masanori Fukushima, they put it on the PlayStation 3 instead. But it's an exclusive only in Japan. So you can't find this anywhere else. So when I saw it, I was like, hey, why don't I buy it just for the heck of it? Because I love this series. So <clears throat> I want to see if there's any changes in the gameplay, any changes in graphics, any changes in the character stories of these three. And let's see what I can rate this game. And if it's any better than the Wii version, do I recommend this game? Let's find out. <laughs> Alright, so today we're talking about Sengoku Musou Moshouden, or otherwise known as Samurai Warriors 3Z, which was originally released on the Nintendo Wii and the PlayStation 3 on February 10th, 2011. And this game has updated graphics because it's on the PS3. As compared to the Nintendo Wii, it's obvious that the PlayStation 3 has superior graphic capabilities. But the only downside to this game is there was actually a mode on Samurai Warriors 3, the original game, on the Nintendo Wii that featured the great Murasame Castle. And you could actually unlock the main character from that game. His name is Takamaru, and that is unavailable on this version. Alright, so for those of you who are unfamiliar with the Samurai Warriors series, it is a straight beat em up, one man versus an entire army type of game. And these games have been out for a long time. And the first of the series was in America, known as Dynasty Warriors 2. And it came out on the PlayStation 2. The company that makes these games is known as Koei. The gameplay is very simple. You mash square if you're using a PlayStation controller a lot. And you can mix it up with the triangle button and make different combos. The Samurai Warriors series is based loosely on the Sengoku Jidai, or the Warring States period of medieval Japan. And these are the stories of those warriors. All right, so let's see what we got. We got the story mode. Oh, it's actually in English. You see that? Like, yeah, because you can see on the bottom uh, right. Let me see if I can move it real quick. Yeah, it's actually a little bit in English. Well, just that. Uh, itself story mode challenge mode historical mode I don't know what that's supposed to mean samurai residence yeah, we'll figure out what that is later original career mode what is that supposed to be um well I know story mode that's pretty simple historical mode I have no idea samurai residence let's just, oh gotcha so this is create a warrior and then I think this is Kakushu Sete. I think that's like changing options, right? Yep, change options. Look at me and my Japanese. I'm getting somewhere. Homotsuko, I don't know. Oh, looking at index, maybe. Maybe. Man, nope. Nope. Wait, movie. Yes, it is looking at endings. So, uh,. Yeah, so far I've unlocked <laughs> only a few endings. Well, I got all of uh, Masanori Fukushima's endings. OK, 
Okay. This is Chigyo Kakutok. This might be for people. Yeah. Adding uh, things to people. Upgrading people. And I think you can get costumes for people too. So you can change the costumes on there. This one I have no idea. I'm not gonna lie, these were probably some of the best costumes they had. Like, uh, I just look like she came out of an anime straight up. But yeah, this guy looked so great on this game. I don't like that they changed him with the white hair and all that. I didn't like that. Uh, Hojo, looking great. Kai, oh my god. Uh, Hotaro. Toshie, yeah, I liked him better on this game than on Summer Warriors 2. Moto Chica, that was some Gakuto looking outfit. I think he's look, he looked more like Gakuto on uh, Samurai Warriors 2, I think. Either 2 or 4. But, oh, I love this suit too. Yes, Shibata. Some great costumes on this game. Uh, Tadakatsu's looked better before. Hmm, let's go now. Mm. Are you ready? Hanzo, my man. Let's see. Nothing special. One of Yukimura's best costumes. Not even gonna lie. It's one of his best costumes. KG, he's looked better. Nobunaga, you've looked better. I can't say it's the best. Kinshi looking bad, bro. I love this one. Eh, eh. Nah, no one cares. Alright, let's go to story mode. Let's go to story mode. See what we got. So I cleared his finally. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Did I unlock anybody? I don't think I did. Oh, it might have been Gra. No, Gracia was already there. Oh well. Take a look at your story, ah yeah, for the first time. All right, let's see how this game looks. Let's take a look. I feel like the loading on this game is annoying. I mean, it's the same as PlayStation 2 or the Wii version, so I can't complain. But it's just annoying compared to the PS4. Oh wow, it goes a lot faster. And it's a lot clearer. Wow. A lot less time for the game or the, the battle to actually start. Wow. And the graphics, my goodness. Yeah, these graphics are a lot better than it used to be. Can I slap you? There you go. Slap, slap. See if I can, see if I can get up close. Oh man, yeah, these graphics. Let me see if I can get her up close. Wow, yeah, these graphics look way better than they used to. All right. You and my slip out light, so get out of my way. Wow. Yeah, these graphics look better than they used to, way better. Wow. Yeah, this game looks great, man. This looks so much better than the Wii version. I'm so happy right now. Uh, uh sure. Um, uh, gotta get rid of one of these. Yeah, bye bye. I don't care. I don't care. Uh, sure, why not? Let's watch his ending.
まあ DS ケンカ超絶ああでもよくやり合ったよな頭でっかちゃそ、so、was this supposed to be a good ending? Like, you guys are basically dead. Just the two of y'all going against the entire. Some of these cutscenes make absolutely no sense, but you know, it's Samurai Warriors. I. I... So, this is the, the, the Japanese old version of sneaking out of the house. You end up on a battlefield. Next to Nobunaga. Yeah, you're gonna get your head cut off. <laughs> you better stay in that box. <laughs>、uh, this is my first time actually seeing this. Come on now. Come on now, I wanna see the bow battle. Okay, there it is. Oh man, even this looks better. This is crazy. Yeah, this game looks a lot better than I expected. Now, this is where I put in a little rant. So, one thing I don't necessarily like about these games is they tend to put in characters that almost have nothing to do with the actual history of Japan. For example, Gracia, which you just previously saw, she is the daughter of Akechi Mitsuhide. And she was, I think, in actual history, a nun. So there is by no means any reason for her to be on the battlefield. They just decided to make her look young and put like a Lolita costume on her just to please the male audience that likes these t y p e of games. And the anime cute girl image. So that just kind of like irks me sometimes. However, I do like the way in which you unlock characters after you complete someone's story, which is comprised of five stages. You can go to a mode in the game where you actually use money that you get from beating someone's story to get a new character. So overall, I will say. s a m u r a i Warriors 3Z has better graphics, the extra three characters. It feels like the game is complete. They should have just put it on PlayStation to begin with. Because when I remember s a m u r a i Warriors 2, s a m u r a i Warriors 2 Extreme Legends, s a m u r a i Warriors 2 Empires, and seeing the progression in graphics between the PlayStation 2 and the PlayStation 3 with s a m u r a i Warriors 3, I think s a m u r a i Warriors 3Z is the perfect. Example of what the PlayStation 3 could do for the series. Now, s a m u r a i Warriors 4 is, it's been out for, I want to say, at least two years now. So we clearly see what the PlayStation 4 can do for the series. But for PlayStation 3, I think the graphics really shocked me at how good they were. Gameplay, it feels a little outdated compared to the new s a m u r a i Warriors 4 because it just feels like it's easier to pick up and play. For Samurai Warriors 4 versus Samurai Warriors 3, I feel like it was a little draggy and you know, the, the, the gameplay is not as good. And it's always been a gripe of mine compared to Dynasty Warriors. The gameplay wasn't as good. But overall, I'd say the gameplay is pretty solid. It's just like the older games with Samurai Warriors 1 and 2. Nothing to complain about. Everything is in Japanese, so it is good Japanese practice. <laughs> You're learning Japanese. The cutscenes are great. I think if you're in Japan, even if you're not in Japan and you have PlayStation 3, you should buy it. Try it out. See how you like it. Overall, I give this game a solid. Even more than the Samurai Warriors 3 game. I was actually very disappointed with Samurai Warriors 3 on the Wii, so this is a step up from that. I definitely recommend this. So, what do you think about this game? And what do you think about this review?、Uh, leave a comment below.
if you share the same feelings or if you want to add something else to my opinion or if you disagree make sure to leave a comment like if you like this video click that like button and subscribe for more videos from your boy Dorio TV I'm out bro deuce deuce